Good evening, my name is Cameron Clark and I am a graduate assistant with the football team at Lenoir Ryan. Uh, we're, today we're going to look at the orientational chart of the football program. Uh, my name is Cameron Clark, as I said. Moving on, this is my perceived chart. At the top we got President Witt, who is the president of the whole school. Uh, and I perceive him as the top of our organization based on the fact that he controls the whole college. He hires everybody who hires the lower people at the top of the hierarchy. And below him we have Kim Pate, who is the athletic director. And she hires pretty much most of the, all the head coaches, which is Mike Keller, who is the head football coach. And under him is Bob McClain, who is the offensive coordinator, and myself. Is kind of below him, as you can see, uh, lines going to and from myself to Coach Kelly and Coach McLean because I'm technically Coach McLean's graduate assistant, but I also work with Coach Keller and directly with, through Coach Keller when he gives me assignments and, and uh, ideas to do stuff for, to help Coach McLean. Moving on to the official chart. At the top of the official chart, we have uh, Kim Pate, who is the director of of intercollegiate athletics and then under her is all her associate ADUs such as Mike, Michael Flicker who is the associate athletic director for sport performance and then you also have the athletic trainers and strength and conditioning you have the sports information director Johnny Cars and you have all these other associate ADs under her and then under all of them you would have the head coaches for all of the sports and then under all the head coaches, you'll have the assistant coaches and graduate assistants for each sport. And here is Mike Keller, who's the head football coach. And we have so many assistants that we can fit on this chart. So they have an attached chart, which we'll look at right now. And this is our attached chart. So we'll have Mike Keller right here, who's the head coach again. And then we have all the assistants from Coach Hill, Coach Lopez, Coach Brock, Coach McLean, Coach Banks, Coach Cole, Coach Harrison, and Coach Harmer. And then under the assistant coaches, you have the three graduate assistants, Aaron Terry, Jawan Turner, and myself, Cameron Clark. And we are all graduate assistants. I am the offensive graduate assistant, so I work with Coach McLean, like I said, who is the offensive coordinator. And then also, I help out Coach Banks, Coach Harrison, and Coach Harmer as well, as they are also on the offensive side of the wall. While Aaron and Jawan mainly work with Coach Lopez and Coach Hill and Coach Cole on the defensive side of the ball as they are, that's their side of the uh, football organization. And the differences in my chart and the official chart as you go back to my chart, I have the president at the top, which I, would, I just thought, hey, he's the president of the school, he would be on top of the organizational chart. But on the official chart, it just starts off with Kent Pate and and I also did not mark any of the, let me go back to the official, I also didn't mark any of the associate ADs in my chart because I don't see them at all during the day really. Or we only see them for athletic meetings. So I did not mention them because they're not kind of in my leadership chart. And then if you go to the attached chart, we also, I have myself linked to Coach McLean on my chart which is not on the official chart because we kind of, we're technically work for just Coach Keller, but like I said, we all branch out into different coaches. Like Coach Terry works with Coach Cole mainly, and Coach Turner works with Coach Lopez mainly, and I work with Coach McClain. So that's the differences in the charts. And the similarities is uh, it goes from Kim Pate, Kim Pate to Coach Keller to Coach McClain to myself in that order kind of. And then where do I see myself in five years? Um, I see myself as an assistant coach, hopefully, with, as a position coach uh, for the offensive line. I, I played offensive line in college, and I, that's where I love coaching. Uh, so hopefully Coach McClain's position, maybe not at Lenore Ryan, but somewhere, because hopefully we win a lot of football games and they stay here and don't get fired. So that's not always a good thing. <laughs> So that's where I would see myself in five years is as a position coach at a college, whether it's D1, D2, or D3. Thank you.